All right, today we're going to talk about shanking tennis balls. And I'm, I'm going to give you a little bit more advice than um, saying, well, you know, Roger Federer keeps his eye on the ball so well and seeing the ball, and that's totally true. And we all should work on that. I, in fact, definitely keep my head as still as I can before I look up. And that's something I need to work on just as much as anyone else. But I'm gonna go over a little bit more with the tension of your arm. And it's going to be a short lesson really because it's pretty simple once you see what I'm talking about. The idea is when the ball goes um, short or you um, shank the ball because they both have similar problems is that we tighten up. And tightening up shortens the swing and it also makes the rack head go up a little too fast, okay? So what I mean by that is if I'm relaxed right here, notice where it's just good. You can do this yourself, but if you grab the racket and you're relaxed, this is about what the angle will be, right? So in your perspective, it's like this. Now, if I tighten up, what happens to the rack ahead? It goes up, right? So if I squeeze too tight, the rack ahead goes up. So the problem then is we are projecting to get under the ball and we're going to stay low the entire time through the ball and then we're going to go and use our momentum of the rack ahead to go up over it. But if I tighten up and I, I tighten up too much, now where am I going to hit the ball? I'm going to hit the bottom of the racket frame and that's exactly what most frames do. We hit the bottom of the racket. So the reason why we, we do this is mainly because we tighten up too much. So we need to relax throughout the swing. So when I relax, I can stay under the ball and then I can go over it with nice effortless uh, swing, but also make good sweet, uh, like hit the sweet spot of the racket. So if I tighten up though, I can really jerk it. I just hit the bottom of the racket frame, just not even trying that. I just tighten up and it hit right here. So the idea then is you gotta feel that. And when you frame the ball, yeah, stay low. Watch the ball, of course, but I don't think anyone really tells people the main reason, in my opinion, is that we're just tight. We tighten up, okay? So kind of, uh, hopefully you can relax a little bit more. Maybe think about dragging the rack ahead um, on, the mat, on the ground as you're swinging to go up through the ball. Same thing on the backhand, because if we tighten up on the backhand, same exact thing, even a one-hander, right? So try to loosen up and maybe that will help you hit, hit balls more in the sweet spot of your racket more frequently. So hope that helps. Enjoy.